Good evening. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to create two masks inspired by the movie The Strangers on your face. No body paint required. All the products I use today will be listed somewhere around the video. Also, please do not forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. And if you have any questions, comments, concerns, feel free to contact me. For the first more doll-like mask, I'm starting off by using an eyebrow pencil and drawing it on my face, as well as lines where the eyes are going to go. Fill in your mask with any extremely pale foundation that you can find. To create a shadow behind the mask, I'm using brown eyeshadows and an angled brush and just going along the outside of the mask, as well as flicking it up a little bit on the edges of the mask since it's creating a shadow. To deepen the shadow, you could also use gray and black eyeshadows. Taking a little bit of blush and then just adding it around my eyebrows, which will be the top of the eyes around my nose, and then adding a deeper blush to my cheeks. I am then using white body paint to fill in the sides of the eyes, but you could also use white eyeliner. Fill in that entire center using a black eyeliner. I'm also filling it in with a little bit of black body paint, but you can definitely just use eyeliner. Also line your eyes normally. Using body paint or black liquid liner, outline the top of your eyes as well as give yourself some eyelashes. Using red lipstick or red body paint, fill in your lips in a doll-like fashion and add the rest of the line using eyeliner, black lipstick, or body paint. Using brown gel eyeliner or body paint, add your eyebrows and a little bit of freckles to the mask. To give the mask shine, use white body paint or white eyeliner and add highlights around the mask. I also decided to take some brown shadows and just add some shading to one side of the mask only to give it some dimension. To create the more pinup looking mask, I first blocked out my eyebrows using a glue stick and then just covered my entire face using that very pale foundation. And you definitely are going to want to powder it. Using black body paint or black eyeliner, fill in your hair. I'll also be listing in the description below what suggestions I would give if you're going to be using regular makeup instead of any body paint at all. Using white body paint or liner, go ahead and highlight your hair. Also trying to blend those shines more into the black because you're going to want to highlight using a brighter white as well. Prime your eyes. Using red eyeshadow, I'm then just messily filling in my lids going all the way up to my brows, as well as using a second darker red eyeshadow to define my new crease. Using eyeliner, go ahead and fill in your entire eyelid as well as a little bit underneath your eye to get more of an open hole shape. Also line your eyes using a regular pencil liner and add your eyelashes. I'm then heavily adding blush. I'm then just contouring my nose and dirtying up the mask using some brown eyeshadow. And just like the other one, fill in your lips using red lipstick and then you could also use eyeliner or black body paint to outline around it. Add all of your highlights using white body paint or white eyeliner and add a little bit of gray shadow underneath this mask, that way you could separate it from your actual face. 